assalamu alaikum everyone i hope you all are doing well from the platform of english buffet.5 i am going to impart you today something of your interest and it is quite different from the previous ones yes we have done many idioms but today's um, perspective or angle of explanation is different as it is holding the movie or media idioms which are in use in the language of media especially they are taken from the movies and tv shows here we go the very first one is popcorn movie what does it mean viewers it is such a movie which is though entertaining to watch but is generally lacking in its quality of emotions and intellectual depth right you can go through the sentences below in written in the form of a dialogue right hope you will be understanding number 2 have my head in the clouds or having someone's head in the clouds it means uh, if someone is lost in the thoughts or someone is daydreaming or not paying attention to something right like i spent most of the day on the sofa just having my head in the clouds means completely lost number 3 pardon my french it means excuse my language when if you are using uh, bad words if your words are not appropriately chosen by you you can be using this phrase it is quite appropriate in that context it is pardon my french means pardon my language number 4 it me it is get the show on the road what does it mean it means putting up a plan or idea into action right and the example of sentence is now that we have completed all the legal formalities let's get the show on the road remember viewers these are the idioms which are uh, taken you can say which are used most of the times in tv shows or movies so on the other side you must also know that these are not uh, that sort of formal idioms though idioms itself um is not something formal yet as these uh, represent uh, the tv shows language and even the language of movies that's why i'm saying that these are not at all these should not be used in the formal settings right next one is jump the shark it means uh, a moment that begins to decline in quality and popularity after reaching its peak means when something is um has done with the success it has enjoyed the success and then its uh, decline starts in such a situation you can be using this idiom that is jumping the shark next one is storm in a teacup viewers it is a sort of exaggerated um, state of uh, you can say anger Uh, like the meaning is a lot of anger or worry about something that is not important right the sentence can be in this way all the reports about global warming are a storm in a teacup right it's not as dangerous as they say let's take number next number 7 it is kick the bucket it means to die right and the example of the sentence is didn't you hear he kicked the bucket a few hours ago right it means that he has died number 8 in in the limelight in the spotlight or we can also say hog the limelight or spotlight it means to be the center of attention of a larger group of people right you can easily use it in any situation wherever you think it is appropriate Number nine is dog and pony show. What does it mean, viewers? A, a presentation which designed to impress an audience but has no real content, right? Means the things are quite pretentious, snobbish, and a, a, like show off, but in fact they do not have any worth or value. You can say inside them. for example the sentence is the candidate's speech was just a dog and pony show and the last one for today's lesson is blue in the face it means a state of extreme frustration 
you can use it in a sentence the way it is written i argued with my supervisor until i was blue in the face means i got upset emotionally i was at the peak of my emotions and frustration that's all thanks for watching i hope you are going to enjoy and uh, you will be uh, using and applying these idioms in your day to day conversations it is going to help you a lot keep on learning keep on enjoying and keep on sharing this knowledge with others as it will be enhancing your own see you soon viewers take care of yourself allah hafiz